In this video, we will try to understand how to find out bending moment at any section xx as shown over here. So the arrangement of the beam is we are having the roller support at point C and hinge support at point D and vertical loading of 5 kN each as shown in the figure. Now as there is only vertical loading is there, we will not consider the horizontal reactions. So vertical reaction at point C is RC and the reaction at point D is RD. So first we will apply the condition of equilibrium over here. That is summation of forces in y direction is equal to 0. Upward forces positive and downward forces negative. So RC and RD they are acting in the upward direction so they are positive. Whereas 5 kN it is acting in the downward direction. This is also acting in the downward direction. So both these forces they are considered as negative. So RC plus RD minus 5 minus 5 is equal to 0. Summation of forces is equal to 0. Now minus 5 and minus 5 will get transferred on the other side that will be 10 kN. Now we have to apply the another condition of equilibrium that is summation of moment is equal to 0. Clockwise positive and anti-clockwise negative. So start from this particular RD. Now this arrow of RD is acting in the upward direction and it is creating a moment, anti-clockwise moment about point C. So perpendicular distance from RD up to point C is 1 plus 1 that is 2. So as it is an anti-clockwise moment it is negative and force into perpendicular distance is 2. Now this will create clockwise moment 5 kN the arrow of this 5 kN it will produce clockwise moment about point C. So 5 and perpendicular distance is 1 so it is 5 into 1. This anti-clockwise moment created by another 5 kN force so 5 into 0.6 that is minus 5 into 0.6 because this is anti-clockwise moment. Now 5 into 1 minus 5 into 0.6 that value comes out to be 2 kilonewton meter minus rd into 2 correct that we have transferred on the other side so it is 2 rd so 2 upon 2 that is 1 so value of reaction at d is 1 kilo newton now we can substitute this value in equation 1 so from equation 1 we are having rc is equal to 10 transfer this plus rd on the other side it is minus 10 rd so 10 minus 1 so that is 9 so we have calculated the reactions that is RC is equal to 9 kN and RD is equal to 1 kN. Now we have to take moment at any section XX as shown over here at a distance of 0.5 meter from the support C. So taking moments we can say that consider all the forces on the left hand side of this particular section XX. We have extrapolated that particular section over here. We will consider all the forces on the left hand side of this. So the moment will be equal to this RC will create clockwise moment as indicated over here and perpendicular distance is 0.5 so 9 into 0.5 whereas this 5 kN force will produce anti-clockwise moment so 5 and perpendicular distance from this end up to this section is 0.6 plus 0.5 that is 1.1. Now as this moment is anti-clockwise it is negative. So this calculation comes out to be minus 1 kilonewton meter. Now we will convert kilonewton into newton. So we have multiplied by 10 to 3. Then meter into mm. So again we have multiplied by 10 to 3. So it is minus 1 into 10 to 6 or minus 10 to 6 newton mm in the anti-clockwise direction. So in this way we can find out the moment at any section in the simply supported B. Thank you very much for watching.